Now from advanced turning and manufacturing, we have uh, corporate trainer Chad Otney and VP of Sales and Marketing, Joe Sorensen. Hi guys. Hey Bart, how, how you doing? doing today? Good, good to see you both. Thank, Thank you. you. You guys uh, are just uh, growing like crazy. We are. So <clears throat> our growth, what we're expecting is about 25 new people at least every year. And we developed this training center last year and it's been very successful throughout this year. So we're, we're excited about it. Yeah, I remember uh, when you were here uh, a year ago, you talked about you guys created your own training in order to get qualified people. Has that, has that been uh, part of the success of your growth? It has, so it, it's really contributed to it. So our sales are you know, starting to go through the roof and we're getting more and more work, which Joe's gonna talk about a little bit with us. Um, and we've been able to take people with zero experience because it's hard to find experienced machinists anymore. So we bring them in and we can train them with all the tools that they need to be able to go to our manufacturing floor and run CNC's. And so far we've successfully put 30 people through the training center this year in onto the manufacturing floor and they're they're striving so wow and when people uh invest themselves into the training at your place do, do they f do you feel like they're more more connected that they're, they're going to be there for the long term i think so yeah it's you know they're they're investing into an education with it and even if it doesn't end up working out it's a it's an education they can take anywhere any machine shop's going to use the same same stuff so Good point. but we want them with us right, right. of course yeah because you put all that and you don't charge them for the <laughs> training either no they actually get paid to go through yeah. our training so and you are you're uh, growing because you keep making things and keep adding uh customers and areas i know uh aerospace uh, medical. medical space exploration is a new industry we're getting into um <clears throat> our main industries are aerospace and medical but the space exploration is something we've had our eyes on for a while. We do have uh, a customer, big space exploration company that we're starting to grow with pretty good. And um, we just experienced record sales last year for 2023. We're expecting at least another $5 million increase in sales next year. And I don't see that slowing down. I would have to say the next four to five years, we could expect that growth with every, um, $5 million in sales growth, we probably need about 25 people. And, and not just machinists on the floor running parts, but we need people in you know, sales, accounting, maintenance. We've got a lot of different areas that we need people. Yeah, you guys have uh, several facilities. Uh, it's not just the, the one advanced turning on Morrill Road. You've got, well, your neighbor you bought. Yeah, we just, uh, three years ago, we acquired Scott Machine. Um, we have a plant up in Westland and but we do operate out of um, three plants here right in Jackson we've got a fourth facility we're starting to produce out of and bring up to help keep up with some of our sales growth awesome so uh, you need people and you're gonna have uh, an event you're teaming up with you're telling me before the show you've been working with Jackson College and uh, also Michigan Works and JAMA yep so we're we're partnering with Jackson College and Michigan Works and that kind of brings us on the show today of uh, you know promoting our job fair that's going to be coming up uh, Wednesday the 10th. So 3 to 6 at the Martin Luther King Center. Uh, we're excited about that. We're hoping for a good turnout. Uh, Advanced Turning, Jackson College, uh, JAMA, and Michigan Works will all be there. So, And we're going to be doing on-the-spot interviews and kind of selected for our next class. Our next class is going to start on the 29th of January. So we have eight seats available in that class, and roughly six weeks later, we'll be holding another class. So we might fill up both classes here. And we're looking for people with experience also. So if they come in, they have experience, they might bypass the training center altogether, and we offer them a job. So what kind of experience would get someone uh, past the training center? So to get past the training center, they would need manufacturing experience, some kind of background in it, know how to run CNC's, have good use of gauges, blueprints, that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. So the training center, we take a lot of people that have zero experience. They've never seen a shop. And they come in and we can teach them everything they know. So. And Joe, people that have never seen a shop, they might have an image of what it looks like, uh, maybe from, their, from mm -hmm. you know, their parents or grandparents. 
they don't look like that anymore. No, it's not a pole barn with a dirt floor and dingy <laughs> lighting anymore. Um, you know, most of our manufacturing cells, we probably have upwards of uh, half a million to three quarters of a million dollars worth of equipment in it. Our floors are polished. We have the best lighting. We have state-of-the-art equipment, technology. Uh, we want to make people feel really good when they're, they're there. Um, you're going to come spend 8, 10, 12 hours a day. It needs to be in a nice environment. Plus the parts that we're producing for um, you know, medical and aerospace industries, they're pretty high tech. We're, you know, you got to have some pretty sophisticated equipment. And the last thing I want is a customer coming in on my floor and seeing that we're really not taking care of business. That wouldn't be a good image to portray. Now, uh, it sounds pretty exciting to be part of space exploration. Uh, obviously, there's uh, several companies worldwide mm -hmm. that are, uh, are into it, but that's really the future. Uh, the governments aren't so much leading the, 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 the field, it's private, private enterprise. You're right. right. I think it's going to take a lot farther than the government driving, yeah. for sure. Now, I would also say Popcorn Wednesdays are a, a, an attraction to- <laughs> Those work. are a big hit. Yep, every <laughs> Wednesday, free popcorn. So. That was something we started doing back in the early 90s, and it's been a hit. Mm -hmm. I can't tell you how many millions of bags of popcorn <laughs> we've given out over the years. <laughs> the uh, other things you guys do, you have your own gym, you have a uh, lunchroom, there's bananas and fruit, and there's, I mean, there's a lot of cool things that uh, I think what people would be surprised that you do these things uh, for your employees, picnics yeah, we, and... Yep, yeah, we try to make it a great company to work for. And like you were talking about, uh, we have Wednesdays, every Wednesday is free popcorn. The, the fruit that they buy is free to all employees. We want them to eat healthy and we want to provide that. It's free coffee every day. So it's, there's a lot of good stuff. We've got a lot of bonus programs that go on mm -hmm. throughout the facilities, so there's always room to make extra money on top of what your hourly pay may be. Well, a little later in today's show, David Barker, our web designer, will be here. And I, we've gotten to know Advanced Turning because uh, David handles the Advanced Turning uh, websites. And the people of Advanced Turning have uh, so much longevity. Uh, that, I think, is pretty telling about how the Machias uh, operate their company. How long have you been there, Joe? Well. 38 years, yeah. working in my 39th year, just right out of high school. Uh, wasn't sure what I was gonna do. I was milking cows for a living at the <laughs> time and I had a chance, uh, John Mackey Sr. gave me an opportunity and I didn't know how to read a set of mics or blueprint, but you know, here I am 38 years later and I've done a lot of different roles in the comp company from running a machine, engineering, sales, plant management, and here I am, vice president of sales and marketing. That is awesome, and yeah. there's many other people that have uh, 30 years, uh, 20, 30 years of service. Mm -hmm. and, and I tell a lot of the new people when they come in, look around. A lot of these people you see in these engineering roles, quality roles, maintenance roles, they came off the shop floor running a machine and, and worked yeah. their way up and learned the company, so we have a lot of opportunities. All right, if you'd like to be part of the uh, excitement that's happening at Advanced Turning, just show up. What should people bring on uh, Wednesday to the King Center? Um, all they really need is themselves, but if they have a resume, they be, can bring that along. It would be helpful. Other than that, we're planning on doing some on-the-spot interviews and kind of screening people there And for our class that starts on the 29th. So. All right, and I, I would add Dress for Success make you're there to make an impression mm -hmm. definitely absolutely make one. all right guys thanks for coming in appreciate nice it part. yeah thank good you. luck on uh, all your ambitious plans for 2024 perfect thank you from advanced turning corporate trainer chad otney and vice president sales and marketing joe sorenson uh,